<laughs> What's happening? Thank y'all for tuning in to a new episode of the Legend Has It Podcast. Man, if it's your first time here, I go by the name of, I seen that. <laughs> I, go by the name of artwork. <laughs> I go by the name of Artwork, man. You already know, it's Bo in the building. See, Bo, what up? Yo, Mr. VA in the building, TZ. Yes, sir. J. Herb in the building. Yeah, and it's the illustrious artist, aka Raul. Raul, what's up, fellas? If y'all didn't understand what just happened, what's happening? What happened? We got, we just introduced the LV six, the whole LV6. baby. The er, first everybody, everybody, everybody on the cast, everybody, tonight, everybody, baby, the whole damn squad. That's a first, right? That's yeah. the first, that first time we ever first did this. Time. Mark this, this shit. shit first. That's me. Oh, this gotta be good then. Mark this shit. It's yeah, gotta be good. Gotta be crazy. It's small. It's, it's gotta get be. like a three hundred views on this. Four hundred. <laughs> stamp this one. How y'all feeling, man? Feeling real good. Man, I feel real good today. I got my shot at ENJ XO. Yeah, you know what? This nigga. Yeah, you know that's <laughs> the only one with a shot. Yeah, they sponsor. They sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> ENJ XO sponsor. No, ENJ. We got, <laughs> we got ENJ yeah. XO sponsor. The ENJ XO. <laughs> Ain't nobody got these bottles but us. The only one with a shot. I can't even take a damn if shot. Y'all want to eat a bottle of ENJ XO? Just gonna hit the deal. Gonna send you something. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know if it's gonna be that XO, but we gonna send you something. It's gonna be that hell now. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Nah, mm-hmm. don't hit us up. That ain't that ain't that ain't right. We're gonna put hair on you. you hey, 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 uh, like I, I love a little light subject we can get into right quick because this nigga just took a shot. Okay. Half right. a shot. I don't like I, I, I'm one of them niggas I don't like taking No shots at all But I like to drink You know what I'm saying Do y'all understand What I'm saying I, I'm with you on that Raul, I like to drink But I don't like Taking on, no shots doing? Why is that though Because them shots Be hitting my They hit my body wrong <laughs> I ain't gonna lie I ain't gonna front It hits your dick They, they hit my body wrong I don't like it It's rough It's terrible It is yeah, look, let, me, let me speak on that Cause okay. I'm not a shot taker but this, you ain't you ain't about to pump me. You ain't gonna pump me. Mike. <laughs> he grew like, like he don't want to do all this bitch. <laughs> you, ain't, you, ain't gonna, you ain't gonna pump me. Oh shit. No, it ain't got nothing to do with that though. Nah, you know it do it, 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 you, you done been there. I have, but I'm saying hey, I don't, fact, I don't I, care you done been there that. with me. Bro, I don't like taking shots. I don't either. What you want? I don't that like ain't it. good for you. I'd rather just have that me a grown. Harsh. I'd rather have a grown man drink. Sit yeah, back exactly. With, yeah, with exactly. Drink my shit it. on some ice yeah, and I'm good. And, and let me sit on it. And I'm gonna it. get drunk on my time. But <laughs> you that not gonna shit. you not gonna pump me. Nah, that shot gonna get you. So drunk you take on shot for else. shot for shot. That yeah, was exactly. Saying. Yeah. Way too quick. Way so, too fast. So Bo, do you take shot for shot if somebody gonna? You ain't gonna pump me. That's what happened to me last it, night. It's been a it's been an episode where we, we <laughs> no, just, it did not. That's really what it, happened it, to me last night. It was a time where we Take just sat here and it, matter of fact, it was me, Raul, and artwork. Oh, we killed that whole bottle. Straight shots. We took that. We shot the whole bottle yeah. down. Yeah, and, and that's it. But mm-hmm. I'm telling you and that we, I didn't like we it. We wasn't happy. <laughs> I, I wasn't like happy the, I didn't like the fact that we was doing it. I, I wasn't, didn't want I to wasn't do happy. That. You didn't say that? You, you wasn't going to be no yeah, punk. Because you ain't going to be no punk. I ain't going to be no bitch. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah. But it's the fact that I didn't really want to do it. Why you didn't say that, man? Because I couldn't be no bitch. Sometimes I'll be grown. I'll be a bitch sometimes because I don't care about that. Um, <laughs> like last night though, sometimes I just get caught up. Yeah, and but you start feeling good, and you like, yo, we just talking, we having a good time, and I just hmm. we just won't go on shot for shot, nothing like that. Like, I was just, on the NJ yeah, yeah, so shot, crazy dude, last night. High yeah, I ain't, we, <laughs> we not high with school. I can't like, do that. Drink we them up that day. Nah, we we shot the whole bottom. Yeah, down. And, and we lined them up every I'm time. I want that for that every time. We did. Yeah, I'm glad I want that for that. How you feel about that taste? I'm like, oh, bro, fuck that. I'm going to be a bitch now, dog. I ain't, <laughs> yeah, I ain't trying to. I'm grown. You ain't, ain't going that. Nah, fuck that shit, I man. don't That's like shots, shot, shot, man. man. I, don't, I don't care. I want to a- say, I'm sorry, Um, not to cut you off, but I am, I was looking at this nigga funny. <laughs> <laughs> like, early in our relationship when we first met, like, he always buy, like, the high-end liquor. There is something to that. 
You found out. Yeah, it is something yeah, to that. You can't drink. You can't drink, you can't drink no bullshit. Day. The next day <laughs> the is. Next that's day. That's what it is. Yeah, yeah. I, I fuck with you. I understand that now. I understand you. Me, I understand me and Bo it's a were difference. talking about that earlier. We was talking about you remember that master blend, right? Mm. Mm. We didn't put master blend in shame. Mm. We we didn't we didn't. That master blend. Master blend like Dope. some regular shit we could drink now. Had the shit that we done bought. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But I wish I could find a bottle of Master Blend right master now. Master you out can't find nothing right now. It's dry. He was talking about that time we was in Atlanta. We tried to kill that bottle of Master Blend and that mm. white hen. No, mm. that, white, that white hen is trash. <laughs> <I don't care>. <laughs> <laughs> Let me say this on camera. For all y'all that go and take vacations and be like, I gotta get this white hen. That shit is garbage. And I totally concur you with know him. What? That shit is trash. That shit is stale. ass. That's a straight headache. Yeah, that's terrible. Yeah, that's uh, nah. But I want you on that artwork. That the money you spend on the night you drink gonna determine your morning. Yeah, yeah you right. Because I'm at an age now. I used to be able to drink like whatever. I drink, you know, whatever. We can go to the damn gro- um, grocery store and get some goddamn Mad Dog, and I'll be good. <laughs> 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 you was a wild dude. Yeah, so, yeah, you was out here. You know what I'm saying? Some wild turkey, whatever. We'd be good. You had on Black Forces while you was <laughs> I, I, I probably did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And I'd be good. Those, bro. Now yeah, to kick those yeah, in. Yeah, kick those on. <laughs> like I woke up this morning, bro. I woke up. We finished what podcasting last night at like what we got home like twelve one o'clock. I woke up at six this morning with a headache and I couldn't go back to sleep, so I was just laying there. My stomach was doing the macarena. (laughs) That shit, you know what I'm saying? Like for no reason. Yeah, I'm Mm -hmm. blowing the covers up, doing the Dutch oven (laughs) under my covers. That shit was bad, man. And then we had to. I knew we had to get up and do some other shit, so I had to get myself together. I text this man. He didn't respond like two hours later, so I know he wasn't up yet. And we had to go do some shit. <laughs> <laughs> so I was fucked up, man. I ain't, yeah, I ain't fucking with y'all no more. I ain't drinking no more. But we did make the lies. Well, Except we said we shot. Make. <laughs> yeah, he bullshit. He didn't make what was going. Shot on camera. And he said, yeah. yeah. That's what. That's yeah. his drink. Yeah. All right. The, okay. The NJ XO. Get you some. If y'all Don't want some it. NJ XO, just hit DM. We get some. <laughs> no, we won't. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> but on on a on a serious note, if you want to wake up like you got some sense the next day, <clears throat> and you got stuff to do, spend some money. My rule of thumb is: ever don't since I go got older, plastic bottle. I got older. If it's not at my chest level, I ain't buying it. If, it, I, it, if it. I if I got to bend down, I don't need it. Mm-hmm. That Damn, that's a point. You got if a it's point. not at chest eye level. Shelf, if I can't do this, like, yeah, you right. Yeah, it's not. Right. I ain't, I can't buy. I don't it. think a lot of um. A lot of people had that luxury though. I mean, absolutely, but, but I think that people are starting to um get more aware to that though. I don't even think they're getting aware. I think it's because of the, the shit we keep going through as far as this drought is concerned. So now it's like it's like a low key drought. Let, I don't let, think a lot of people know about. Let me try this. Right, yeah. Then they try this and they be like, "Oh, I love this. Yeah. I don't feel like I did when I was drinking what <laughs> I was drinking." Weird too. And now I mean, Man, that's not the case. Y'all are some alcoholics. That's, that's, that's definitely not the case. Because <laughs> we like what we like, and then it rec- 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 yeah, I don't think we that's don't the case. I just think is no, we don't, don't drink know. every day, so ain't selling no alcohol. Y'all bougie, <clears throat> man. You you know how you woke up this morning? I did. I'm, I'm with you. I did. I'm, hey man, I'm I, can I can I be vulnerable for a second? <laughs> <laughs> sure. Do you I think? like. I, I mean, I always tell shit that I shouldn't be saying. I don't say anything. I don't give a fuck. I told y'all. I'm telling everybody. I woke up this morning. My stomach was doing the Y two C. Nigga, I shit it like uh, five times. This oh, morning. Geez. <laughs> that might have been TMI right My there, stomach know, was going ability. crazy. Uh, that's, that's, that's TMI. That ain't vulnerable. And I don't know what was going on. I, I man, my tell stomach I was tell you. crazy. You bit down to buy that bottle of liquor. <laughs> I Look. didn't even drink none of the regular though. You didn't drink none of them? No, I drank the black bottle. Oh, God. <laughs> no, it was that food we ate. I, I think it was the food. It could have been. I understand the food. where you're coming from because I'm going to tell you the first place I went this morning when I got up. You <laughs> <laughs> said, I'm going to be vulnerable. Man, I took five. The first shit. place I went this morning I, and I, when I woke up was to CVS. He would have got some PDL life. He had to go. He had to go and get some Dell, some, the, some medicine. I went on the paper out. I needed some wet wipes for my oh. head because <laughs> hey, I knew hey, look. what was hey, getting ready. Hey, no, no, hold on. He already Bro, knew what was about to go down. Pro tip. Pro tip. 
Keep the wet white. I keep the wet white. I was out. I keep the wet white in the house. I knew what was going down. Well, wet white is going to be there no matter yes, what. I, I, if I, I'm buying toilet paper, I'm buying wet white right with that it. That was my trip Mike. this morning. I, I, why you laughing? Nah, wet white is essential. Oh, why you laughing? Wet white is essential. No, you do need the wet white though. I rolled out of bed. I made a beeline to the wet white. That's what I did. Hey, T, you see what you've been missing? <laughs> Let me go. go. Fuck. Riveting content. Riveting as <laughs> motherfucker. That's real that, shit, though. Oh, yeah, if, I mean, if I got some toilet paper in my house, the wet wipes going to be right there beside it. I get the five pack of wet wipes every time I go to Walmart. I hardly even use toilet paper, man. I take one whoa, swipe whoa, with... I don't, no, check it. I take one swipe with the toilet paper and the rest is all wet wipes. It, Okay. No, all, you, are you 100% right? All wet wipes. You, you, know, you, know what no, you got to get the majority out. Yeah. You give a nigga a tech mask. No, that's real. Hey, look. What are we going to do? You get the snicker bar. I'm giving y'all a pro tip. You get the snicker bar wrap out. You get the 95% out with the toilet, with the tissue paper. You get the rest of it out with the wet wipe. You going to come out clean. You ready for ass eating. If that shit ain't... Yo, cut, man, cut. We done. Yo, we we back. Like a rap. We back. But yeah, man, if y'all don't use wet wipes, man, you out here fucking up. Nasty. You need to jump in the shower after you take a shit. <laughs> and I know none of y'all ain't doing that. Nasty. After every time you take a shit, so. Go get some wet wipes. Hit them wipes every time you take a shit. Yeah, if it's if it's you know them shits that be like muddy, and you gotta wipe your ass like hundred times, you gotta get in the shower if you ain't got no wet wipes. If you ain't got no wet wipes. He said muddy. <laughs> hey, bro, muddy might be the good one. I don't know why more it people might be don't the like the ones that you need to damn cr- jump in the shower. The what? Them shits wasn't that it, it wasn't coming out right. You know them shit. The muddy ones stick to your butt hair. I mean, the muddy ones is it, they they ridiculous. Like <laughs> you can't even get on. You can't even go on with your day when you got a muddy butt. Yo, TZ, what you want to talk about, man? Because we <laughs> yeah, because I don't really understand how we got. <laughs> no, it's a real situation though. I mean, it's a real situation. I think more people need to get wet wipes for one thing. If you ain't got wet wipes, what are you doing with your life? Yes, yeah, but. And then when you got the mud butt, you don't wipe your butt 52 times. I'm talking about 52 times. Use and whole, that shit still coming out. It ain't use clean. a whole roll of paper. <laughs> it ain't clean. It's coming out still with a little brown on there. You're like, God you damn, going. bro. You got to keep going. Yeah, you got to keep wiping. You got to keep going. Toilet. No, you just gotta. Up. You gotta get in the shop. Yeah, you need to wash your ass. You gotta hold. <laughs> you gotta hold I'm your butt hole open. I'm talking about the toilet packed up. You ain't even. No, you need a. You need a bidet. That's what the fuck you need. Let the water hit your ass. You need a whole bidet. Yeah. You need to get a bidet. Yeah. You gotta let the water hit your ass. Yeah. yeah. After, right in your crack. After 52 times, you gotta let the water hit your ass. Get a little First splash. Off, you ain't flushing all that. You got to though. No, you got a curse. That's what I'm saying. You get to that point, you got to flush halfway. Don't Before you it. get to 52, you got to flush by halfway, by 38. That's too much. I, I'm gonna tell, let me tell y'all. Man. Hey, I um, every time I go home, like mama, I love you, mama. <laughs> oh shit. But if I go when I go home to Georgia, Georgia, she always got like the one ply. Ah, oh, my mama too. Mama. I, like ma, no, what no, the no, fuck is on. you doing with one ply? No, you know you. Wipe your ass and your finger go Time through out. it. Time That's out, the bro. worst. Why you let your mama have one? Plot? I don't know, man. Nah, I don't man. understand Look, it. I give my mom toilet paper. I don't bought from saying I the one we got from work, and she still buy one ply. But why would you ever buy one ply? I don't understand ever, it. Ever, dog. This is what I. Y'all see it right now? Oh, this, man. this is Real my. Shit. This is my view on that. That's what they know, and they've been buying what they know for. I'm trying to upgrade your life. You, we've been around, you got to roll off on one we've fly. been around to tell them that, it, hey, they got this with the aloe and the, the blah, blah. They, 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 they and one ply ain't soft either. It's like construction yeah, paper. I don't think they put That's that. That's sandpaper. I don't think they put that in, that in the one ply. That's just sandpaper. One ply, you going, you going Viking style. They don't know no difference. That's what they been, they been using. Your ass That's used to. That's what I mean that you... Like, if you, if you comfortable with one ply, that means that you ready for some shit to be on your hand. Throw it out. You been thawed out. <laughs> you been thawed out. No, for some you want years. you about to slip your thing in your ass and ah. you don't want to fly. How we? How we care? Foot, man. 
Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> uh, if your mama, if your mama that, and she went to one ply, she was using the one ply when it wasn't Love your mama. available. And she <laughs> never stopped. That's just, all it is. No, because hey, if you doing one content. ply, your ass, your face going in your ass. But don't you know? That's hey, uh, you gotta don't say you it. Mean. You gotta say it. That's what I'm saying. This it is just for content. At one point in time, it wasn't nothing else we, available. We have gone too so far. That's all they know. Hey, was that never available? Boy, you got you. you got nah, back in the day, that's all they had was like one ply. Like back that's in it. the, that's all they had. Content, y'all didn't the know. The dog is motherfucking lying. You ain't lived through that. How long y'all been there? One plot was the only thing you can get out the ghost stuff. You ain't lived through it. When they was coming Maybe up. none of us lived through it. When they, was, they did. I look, I grew up. Hey man. I grew you up. You know better, you do better. Yeah, you right. You don't have to do that. I remember when you I was know? first coming up, I was a little jit, right? Little In North Carolina. They had a, my mama and them had an outhouse. My great aunt had an outhouse. Yeah, they when had I an outhouse. Where, like when I'm my grandparents' house, I had an outhouse. That shit was right across the sh- right where she lived. It. She didn't have no. She didn't have no working electricity in her house. Exactly. So you think she had an outhouse? Some damn two ply, nigga. Some aloe and my grand come from outhouse. No man, you don't have to do that. You they, she didn't have to do that. They don't know, nigga. You not sticking on one ply up there and just going to town, bro. <laughs> I, I, you shouldn't go to town anyway But <laughs> <laughs> Y'all ever use the outhouse? Nah I, I, I don't have any experience with the outhouse You sound like hey, a man, party. Can I speak on that? The outhouse is disgusting Can I speak on that? You can it's That space. is some of the scariest shit Literally Y'all new niggas don't know nothing about the outhouse life That is oh. some of the scariest shit that you ever did in your life I swear to God You got a hole and you know in the hole you ain't got nothing but it's just it's just a hole. You put your ass over this hole, you don't know what's down in that hole. It's dark and it's stank. That's it all you know. It's horrible. <laughs> and you got So that mean if you sit on this, if you even if you got the uh, the bravery to sit on it, you don't know what the fuck you don't know if animals coming out of there. You don't know it's if insects coming out of there, By your ass. all you know is that you seen your ass down and you handling your business. You don't know where this shit going when, when you do it. You don't know what's coming back on you after you do it. That shit is crazy. I don't understand if how y'all could do that if you do it. I know I done been in a situation where I could do it and I couldn't do it. That shit is nasty. I can't do that shit. Yeah, my, my grandparents had an outhouse when I was young, so... That, was, that was, shit was crazy Our outhouse is crazy And it's not nothing practical either That's something weird Just imagine having to go Nasty to Go use that shit When it's in the dead of winter When it's like 40, 30 degrees outside And you gotta go out there And take it You know Hold my shit Nah you ain't holding that yeah, shit That's the only thing you had That's all you got all you Yeah But she didn't have no electricity In her house So that mean The only thing she could do Is go to her house And take a shit Or do whatever she had to do Right Mm-hmm. So I mean, she ain't had no other choice. This is what she knew. This is what she only thing she knew. That shit was crazy, bro. Even when I went in there, I was so scared to go in there. I would never. I never used bathroom in there. I was scared to go in there. So where you bathroom at? Say what? You say you never used the bathroom over there? No, hell no. This was my great aunt. She lived right on, like my grand. My grandparents live on the same property with her. That was like my grandfather's aunt, I think. She lived on the same property with her. So we used to go over her house. She had a house that didn't have no no electricity. Mm. And she had an outhouse. So we she would go over. House didn't have... She had a house, but she had an outhouse. No, she had a house in the area that right. didn't have no electricity. My grandparents had electricity, but she didn't. So she was the only house. She chose not to. Or? It was probably no, like a real was, old house. Yeah, oh, she no, never no, like her house was made in like eighteen. Yeah, she oh, okay, never. Okay. It yeah, never it really that, got. It was that type of old. <clears throat> I'm talking about her house was old as shit. You know what I'm saying? Eighteen <laughs> hundred type house. So she ain't had no electricity. She had an outhouse on the side of her house. So when she used the bathroom, she went out to the house and had her business. So that, we always used it. We was me and my brother was young as shit. So we used to go there and fuck with her. On her outhouse, bro. If you ain't go out there to do your business, you was gonna be out there doing whatever. And that shit was scary. I'm, I'm talking about scary to the point where I ain't, I wouldn't even do it. Now, now I'm talking about now me a grown ass man. 
I don't wanna do this shit now. Nah. That shit was nasty. I've used it before, but it was it was it was it's not some it's not ideal. It's just cause I didn't know no better. I was so young at the time. It was in two five two. The two five two shit they be yeah, right. my grandma, that's where they from, the 252 mm. and shit. So, yeah, man, I don't know something about the 252, man. <laughs> that shit ain't, that shit ain't right. Yeah, it ain't right. What's going on, no, no. I don't know. Shit ain't right. I ain't got no bathroom down there. No that outhouse. shit ain't right. Close, I came with porta potty. Outhouses. They got outhouses. I can't say that, bro. They using the fly hole. Using porta potty <laughs> shit. Fuck that. 252. Man, use a porta potty. Yeah. Yeah. Yo. Fly. I mean, let's get off this. Uh, fly uh, hole and uh, we've been talking a lot of shit. Literally, Nasty literally, shit. yeah, <laughs> literally. Let me ask y'all something, man. As men, man, what do y'all do when y'all like feel down and sad? Do y'all ever feel down and sad? Do y'all uh, come to grips with that, or do y'all just ignore it? Mm. Acting as men, as nice black move. men. There you go. See, he just ignore it. I heard what you said. He just ignore it. Yeah, I'm gonna let y'all speak first. I don't want to be. Y'all go ahead. Okay, not even sad. What do you when you not feeling like yourself? Not feeling quite like yourself. You feeling out of sorts, and you you know might be feeling frustrated. Whatever emotion it is, you just not feeling like your usual self. Yeah, your usual self. What what do you do when you do when when that happens? Do you do anything different, or do you? Hey, nigga, see, oh my again. god. We see we can't even pause that. Oh my god. Nigga, what the fuck? Oh my god. I'm sorry, bro. We just I'm seen sorry. that live, bro. I'm sorry. Where was I'm he? Sorry. Did Where y'all was... see this bullshit? Where was he? Yeah. Hey, cut. Where are you at? You wasn't there. Are you here? We just seen it live, bro. Like, come what on. What are you man. doing? That's, That's a highlight. This the same <laughs> guy. No, I thought it was overtime. <laughs> we just seen <laughs> that live. Oh my god. Oh, I thought it was it was overtime. It ended. But we seen it live. This is a replay. No, I thought it was. No, the game over. It been oh, over. Yeah. It's been like 20 oh, minutes. My fault. I'm sorry. My goodness, man. Look. <laughs> hey, 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 I'm sorry. You just yeah. talked. No. To- <laughs> This don't, don't, don't cut this out. Nah, leave this shit in here. Hey, yo, look. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Bruh. We <laughs> What the fuck? I'm sorry. He just so he commented sad. on it, and then act like you ain't I never seen it. A, no, I thought that's it was the greatest play he ever saw in his life again. In the world's hour, this this might be my oh, la- last no. part. What? 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 I was like, I know what you like. Bro, what are you talking about? Well, that shit scared me a little bit, bro. I thought something new happened. I was like, damn. Did they bring the plans back out? Oh, what are we talking about? Them? We missed them. <laughs> But I'm saying, what are we talking about? <laughs> they brought the plans back out. <laughs> we missed them all. This dude, man. But I'm saying, what, 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 what were we talking about? <laughs> it won't let. Whatever, whatever that shit was, man. that won't let, bro. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. Look, cause just cause we ain't gonna cut this out. <laughs> oh my god! I want y'all to know. Yeah. What, what, the what, what the final four was going on. Oh my god! We were talking about what? And Gonzaga and UCLA was playing, and I'm pretty sure y'all saw it. So <laughs> yeah, and saw it twice. And, and thought it was a new one. Twice. Reaction right there. I'm that sorry. Was their reaction. He I'm reacted sorry. the right. second time. The I don't know time. if he reacted the first time, but he, he, he did the second time. He commented on it. I'm sorry. We had a whole discussion. <laughs> but like I said, uh, anyway, that's what happens when you drink E and J XO. So yeah, yeah. that spice. Yeah, that y'all want E and J XO? Hit the DM and y'all can get some. Man, as men, yo, as as black men especially, like, what do y'all do? Like when y'all not feeling like yourselves, when you feeling down, or what do you do? What do you go to? Like, do who you talk to, do you do anything different, or you just, like, try to shake it off and come up out of it, and you repress those feelings? And if you mm-hmm. so, if so, is that healthy to do? Probably not. But to suppress the feeling? Yeah. Definitely. We definitely not, but, yeah, I think that's the issue anyway. with most men, though. We suppress our feelings most of the time, I feel like. So you don't do anything different when you feel No, I mean, I ain't gonna say I do nothing different, but I, I think I do... I think I I I'm, I think I'll be myself. Like um you know more I do the shit that I would have been doing anyway. So, if I was going to be 
You try to take your mind off of shit? Yeah, you know, I was going to be playing the game or DJing or whatever I was going to be doing. I was, I'm, I'm going to do more of that. Like, mm-hmm. if I had, like, a... More stuff you do like. Yeah, if I was shit, I was doing anyway. <clears throat> I'm going to do that anyway. And then the other shit that you already knew that I was going to be off on anyway, you ain't going to know it anyway. So, like, okay, so... So you don't show it. That's what you're saying. You're suppressing. I'm That's saying that was. I would do what I was going to do anyway and other shit that would bother me. You don't do. I'm saying how do you deal with it, though? That's what I'm asking. You don't. I do the or... shit that bring me enjoyment. Okay. So say, for okay. instance, like, all right, so y'all know I'm this type of nigga, right? But if I DJ or I'm doing some other shit, You'd be like, oh, that's DJ Uh huh or Raul or whatever. I'm gonna do that more than I, what I would do if I was being uh, how I would normally be. So you go into your place of silence, right? I'm gonna do my own thing in a place where I feel good about myself. You so know I what I'm saying? That's most people, you right? Know what I'm saying like, I know for me, like growing up <clears throat> when I was playing ball all the time. I don't give a fuck what the fuck I was going through when I was on the basketball court. Nothing mattered. Like, won't. I don't remember shit that's going on in the world. I don't know who done pissed me off. I don't know who gave me a bad day. Nothing matters. So I think that's like most people. If you have, but that's only if you have that thing that you can go to to be like, yo, I can step into this lane. Some people don't. Just be like, yeah, everybody don't. <clears throat> but I also feel like. What if you're the person that in your circle, everybody always come to you mm-hmm. with their problems? You're always fixing everybody else's problems. <clears throat> Anytime anybody has something that they, you know they going through, they always come to you for advice for whatever the case may be. Right? They're using you as like emotional support. So you're that guy. So that weighs, that weighs heavy on you too. So sometimes. right. So here's the thing though. So if you're that man, it's like so. The question you asked was, when you're going through something, who you, what do you do? I think a lot of times it's that person you really don't. You follow it in. Yeah, because you don't know who to go yeah, to. Because right. you you're, always you're, that you're person. To be the so rock. you suppress. Your I don't, right. well, but mind, I don't think you follow in though. I don't advise you being that person. Oh no, I don't. I that's, definitely don't. That's not. Uh, I don't think you follow it in. You want to do? I think that you. If you <clears throat> let that be, all right. So everybody know that how you are. And you take on that responsibility. I think you took on that responsibility. You kind of, when the, when the lights is off, you kind of took that on. You know what I'm saying? But maybe it's a gift. Yeah, like but it gets to a point where curse. I feel like. Yeah, it, but I don't I'm know. I'm, I think I'm not speaking on this game. I feel like to, it gets to a point where you will get to that point where you like, I can't do this no more because it's taking too much from me. Trying to make everybody else happy and ain't nobody really. All right. You know how you see the, the post that be like. <laughs> people like that become friend. bitter. Yeah, people be like that, that become bitter because yeah, yeah. they feel like they don't have nothing to do. But, but I also think if you take upon yourself to be that person, that you take it upon yourself to be like, all right, so now I'm telling y'all, when y'all putting on something on me, I can't handle it. So now I'm putting it back on y'all. That's not so how it works all the time. Handle it. I don't think, I don't even think, way. I think sometimes you ain't even, like, it's not even just you saying, I'm going to take it upon myself. It's just is, your personality, your personality and people, that people know that they can be, come to yeah. you. So that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Okay, so then when your personality is that, yeah. right, of that person that in your circle, all your people, whether it's friends and family, whatever, they always come to you because you're the rock. And they, you're the emotional support. And they end up mm-hmm. burning you out. So even if it, even if it, so here's the thing, Corey, even if it don't burn you out, it's it's going to be become a time where it always be like, yo, this is a lot, whatever, whatever, right? Yes, right. but it's still your personality. This is still what you do. You figure it out. You help other people. But here's the thing. The question, though, was asked, asked me, and what do we do? What if you're that person that you're that rock? In your mind, do you openly feel like, well, I know if I'm going through something, I have somebody to turn to? Or do you feel like, if I'm going through something, then I'm supposed to be that rock? Like, it's almost a perception of, 
I'm almost supposed to have. I'm almost always supposed to have shit together. Yeah, you ain't supposed. You, know, you ain't supposed to go through nothing. They look at you like. You ain't, you so ain't who do the person look so towards? Who toward? you turn to? Right, right. Who do you look towards? So how do how do you mm, get the like? That's what I'm asking. That's the question. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. That's a, so like, but if you're that guy, because that's a different. You can ask somebody who's not that guy. They can say, "Well, look, yeah, that's true." You know, I I'm quick to call such and such up and say, "I'm." But they hit. They, they hit the guy though. They they quit to call right. somebody up. That's yeah. not their job. But when you're that guy, but that what rock? It, how for, do you tell somebody like, "Hey, man, look"? For me you're though, going through something, you need to get it out. I don't. So I don't talk to nobody really. <laughs> And I don't, you know what I'm saying? I don't talk because I don't. I always feel like people got their own shit to deal with, so I don't go to nobody with nothing. So I don't talk to nobody. I try to find other ways to to deal with to it. deal with it. All right, but look though, right, so what you saying? Is, is Sometimes it's not. This is, this, is, this is something that I do, and it might not be always right, but it might make me feel better. But. I would get in my car, get on the highway, and depends on what type of mood I'm in. It's gonna be the music. I ride. That's gonna yeah. take my. I do that shit too. I ride. I at. ride. Yeah. So you saying Young Dolph? It is. It, it, <laughs> oh. it might be. Okay. <laughs> it's possible. Yeah, yeah. It yeah. might be his day. Okay. Yeah, I'm that I'm there, but it just depends on. But that's something that I do. And I don't know if that's All right, so is that for, enough though? It yes. works. But look for but y'all. That, but is, is that, is that, that all the time? Uh, it works. Remedy in the situation at the moment. It works. Or does it clear it all together? It works. It depends on the it depends situation. On what it is and how long the ride is. It's like a pressure pressure release valve yeah, where you can. Yeah, yeah, all right, yeah. so for y'all that, that <clears throat> have that same pressure on you, do you feel like just having somebody like like uh, like you said music to release to? Is that gonna be the only thing? Like, if you might not say the same thing, but if you had that same issue, right? If you had that same like that, you might not have that same that that music. Him might not mean the same thing to you. Yeah. So, <clears throat> how you gonna release that pressure off of you to be able to deal with that situation? I don't know. I just do. I don't know, man. I think I might bottle some shit because I got people to ask me now. Like, you know, I got a, a person to ask me. You, you good? And I'll be like, I'm good. And she might be like, Would you but tell then, me if you wasn't? And I'll be it, like, Nah. Alright, so so check this out. Nah, so but I'm even because like, even if I'm not good, you tell them that you good. Are you I'm really good. good. Are you really good though? I think that's a man trait. But though. even if I'm not good, I feel like I'm good. I'm gonna be good. No, but I'm saying, yeah, why would you say you good when you're not when you're not good? Because I don't want to burden nobody hey, else with what no bullshit. She, you know what I'm saying? It's a man thing, man. But what if she's a man? I don't care what she want. I don't want. I ain't trying to put that on nobody else. Like but I understand you, you got your own oh, shit. But when right. you don't if speak your action. truth, now you putting pressure on somebody else because they think you good. They ain't trying to help you out. Now yeah, you but if she think I'm good, then she good. She gonna stay good. No, but what if she or, you put more pressure good. on yourself. She ain't gonna know that. Yes, she is. No, but you put more pressure on yourself because you didn't even tell the truth while you was. Ain't no pressure on me. It's me not putting no pressure on nobody else. I'm, I'm, a, I handle but what I handle. Ain't no pressure you on know. me. Ain't no pressure on me. Yeah, if ain't I no tell pressure you, on me. Like it's like, like no, me, I'm no, saying, no, 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 no. I, I am that guy that in in the circle, like everybody comes to for advice, or whatever. Right, I'm that guy. Yeah. And it's easy for me. That's just my personality, right? But I am the same guy. That if I'm going through shit, you would never know. Never know. But that don't help you out as actually, individual. But I think I think with that though is actually different. I think you have to know yourself because if if you know you're that person if you store shit and the shit builds up and then you explode, get help. But if you know you're the type of person that listen, I'll help you all day all day all day long. I don't have a problem with that. But my shit, I'll handle my shit and I know how to handle my shit. If I'm down, I've got myself out of it before I can get myself out of it again. So it don't, I, I relieve my own pressure. Even though you may say it builds up, I know how to control that valve to where if it start building up fast, I can dial it down. Even though it, I control that shit. If you can't control it and it builds up and then you explode, that's when it's an issue. And if you don't know yourself, if you're going through shit where you're starting to build up, that's those are the people who need to get help. 
talk to somebody yeah. whatever the case may be. If you yeah. asking me that though, that shit don't put no pressure on me. I'm cool. I can handle my own shit. But that's what I'm saying though. Some people ain't like that. Yeah, exactly. A lot of people ain't like that. You gotta know yourself though. Yeah, yeah, I I ain't always been like that. I used to blow I up. I used to hold shit in until it got to a point where I would just explode. Me and motherfuckers neither. would be it's looking exactly at me like, damn, way. I didn't even, like, who are you? Exactly. See, I'm, because I would hold I don't in. know if I'm to that space. I'm, I'm, I think I'm, I'm to the a, point. I'm in a space where <clears throat> I really don't give a fuck about a lot of shit. I think I'm, that's how I, I am I think now. I'm the so same place where you at. That helps you get I might bother me for a minute. When y'all start giving a fuck, like I give a fuck, then I start caring. Then I'm, shit, it is what it That's is. That's when, when you find your place I'm, of solace. I'm either going to figure it out or I'm not. I mean, but damn it, it ain't going to stop me from moving. I mean, you know what I'm saying? That's it, how I am now. It but is what it is, dog. I'm the same way now it, because it, I don't. Some shit you can't do nothing about. Yeah, exactly. I can't it's control. Like, control. 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 how you feel. Yeah. Exactly. It's some shit you ain't, you, it ain't it's nothing life. you can do. So I don't so give a fuck. no point in you sitting there it's and letting that shit wreck you. Because you can't do nothing about it. But no. you can't it's do a, nothing about it. You but gotta, I'm saying you if you if you let that, it, it's gonna tear you up. Yeah, so you got you to realize you that's that the, thing, the key word. Shit I the can't key do. words are if you let it. Yeah, right. If you let it. Yeah. yeah. It's some shit that you can't you ain't got no control over a lot of shit. And you gotta realize that. And it might bother you, but let it bother you. Here's how I look at it. it. I look yeah. at it like this. Moving. Everything, see, I don't, I ain't got to the age, but everybody isn't like that. But I understand a lot of that shit comes yeah, with age and wisdom. Yeah. So I got to the age now where I look back at my life, everything that I've been through has always worked out some way or the other. God has had me in every situation. Everything has always worked out. Whether I didn't know it at the time, even if I was worried about it, it worked out in some type of way. So I don't even worry about it no more. It's like it's going to be what it is. But that's when you get to the point where you say, okay. Every problem that I've been through, I didn't go tell somebody else. Yeah, so it worked. Out. It worked out. I handled my business. So it now I don't even worry about it. It's like, yo, what if you I go know problems, when you in that situation, one thing I don't work out like that. Say but what? When you that type of person, you gonna let you gonna let the shit work out like that. Some people ain't gonna let it work yeah, out. Yeah, that's what yeah, I'm exactly. saying. Sometimes that's it comes with like, age and wisdom. You have, you have to know who you are. You gotta know right. who you are. And how yeah, I know yeah, who yeah. I am, so I know shit don't buy. Like I know I'm gonna get myself out of. Right. But the ones who can't, what you think, Er? How you feel? How you feel about it? I'm sorry, I ain't in the mic. No, you good. Uh, just saying, like I've done that. Like I'm, I'm at a point where it's like I let go and let God deal with it, man. If I can't, get, if it's not in my control, I ain't got, I can't do nothing about it. I feel the same. I'm kind of, I'm kind of like. It is what it is. I keep moving. Yeah. Like I'm like Boda at times. It pissed me off for that moment. Yeah, because you can't. At you human. Time. It's gonna. It's, it's gonna it's, fuck it's, with you in the moment. Yeah. But it's, in the moment, it's, it's shit with, with relationships. Yeah. We got I with people. Why. It's your job. It's everything that you be like. Well, fuck. I mean, you even piss me the fuck off. I'm all right. Cool. I'm. I'm going to the next thing. Cause fuck it. Like if it's like I ain't fucking with it. It's whatever. But at a lot of at a lot of instances it came that I have gained anxiety by holding my emotions inside too. Yeah, I can see that. It's, it's you. What, you you got to have some type of release. That's why yeah. I asked the question. You you do like something. It, like he said, he go out. You might. Right. I, I've I think done. A lot of people don't know when they where, where they release it. Sometimes I might go like buy yeah. some shit. Sometimes I make me yeah, feel it, a little better. Some you know, people even got, if it's the moment, I might go buy. Yeah. It, like, so, I mean. It's called yeah, retail on therapy. On a smaller scale, but then if you You're deal driving. with a big issue, that ain't gonna solve the problem. I might jack off. Mm-hmm. Chill out, man. Hey, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, come I mean, on, man. Is, hey, man, cut. I mean, I'm saying. Hey, cut. I mean, I used to. I used to draw. <laughs> I used to. Yeah, draw. <laughs> hey, yo, man, I'm cut. Release, I make music. Yeah, you know make what I'm music. Saying? Whatever. That's like, what's music. your enjoyment that yeah. you know gets your mind off that. Specific I mean, thing that's what I was saying earlier. This thing is talking about jacking off. Yeah. So if you a no, man out no, there, no, 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 cry no. jack off. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, we shedding a tear. And just, but anyway, if you a man out there, man, find something that you you know that you hey into. Man, this nigga Arden jacked off and then shot in his dreads, like, yo. It's sometimes where. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, go ahead, Bodie, bro. What was you about to say, Cub? Oh, my man. What I was about to say. Why are you your wife? Goddamn, dog. Like he went too far. Like I say, I might take a ride, <laughs> and that might do it for me. But <laughs> sometimes I might just want to sit down and. Chill out. And have me a drink. Yeah. Ah. What you said? I'm with you on that. My man Rose is like. Give me a, a, a decent bottle and sit down. Decent bottle of NJXO? 
<laughs> and then by the time you finish and that drink. And let all the shit go. Yeah. By the time you finish that drink. I can just sit down. You at the point you want to be at. Nice little steel reserve. Just sit the fuck down. Yeah. That might be temporary though. Sometimes but saying, a lot of shit is temporary though. Most of shit is temporary. Like, you gotta is temporary. get to the point that you <gasps> understand that you can't. Control There's something wrong with you. Every now. fucking thing, dog. A lot of shit is out of your so control. It's a lot of shit. That a lot of shit, man. It'd be some fucked up shit. You can't do nothing about it. It doesn't happen. It is. It's, Regardless of who coming to you with it, who talking to you about it, I think they that's might life. feel some type of way when you be like. Tell them, I tell. But sometimes when you take care of yourself, everybody else don't matter. Take you care should. of yourself first. But, that, God, but that's, but that's be a standard selfish, though. Man, take care of yourself. You have to be selfish by can't, default. Right. You have to. Right. right. Can't, can't nobody gonna can't take care of you. Yeah, ain't nobody yeah, gonna take care of you like. Later. But ain't nobody gonna take like, care of you like you self. Self up. Right. Ain't nobody gonna take care of you like. Cause you know yourself. When everybody come to if you that person, they coming to you and they, I need this. I um, tell me what I should do about this. And then you giving them your energy, you fucking That's yourself it. up in the long run. Energy. That transfer energy, man. You ain't got nothing positive left. So if you ain't happy with yourself, you can't Blame help them. them. Yeah. You yeah. can't help them. Yeah, you're right. But can't, right. if you're not happy with yourself, you're right. can you blame somebody else for your not being happy? Hell no. Mm-mm. Some people do, though. That's the thing. Yeah. You control your own happiness. Like I'm saying, if you ain't if you ain't making yourself happy, you can't help nobody else. Right. Yeah. I 100 percent agree with that. Yeah. You can drop the mic on that, Montel. And <laughs> find you an outlet, man. Figure out a way to deal with it. Don't just suppress it. If you're going through something, that shit can fuck you up. And don't let people just dump their shit on you either all the time. That shit you know? causes health problems. Man, oh, what you uh, say? Man. People dump their shit on you all the time. Without even knowing it, yeah. they, they, I don't even think they know they be dumping their yeah, shit on you. Nah. Nah. Don't sick behind that. That's, it becomes natural, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah that, that shit causes all kinds yeah. of issues. Yeah, it's like, a transfer why, why of energy too, man. Tell, like, why you tell me that? It's a transfer of energy. You, they put in they, and then you feel bad. It fucks your shit, whole yeah. whole shit up. And then it be, it would be the reverse because motherfuckers would be upset with you because you really don't know. Come off like. I don't mm. give a fuck. Like, you don't care. Uh, like an asshole. But it ain't like, that you don't give a fuck. You just but, understand the fact that you can't do nothing. You know what the crazy shit is? Yeah, like you, they off. tell you yeah, shit that ain't, nah, that ain't no this problem. One. It ain't. What happened? You heard me. Yeah, you, you ain't, ain't even They tell you shit that, that dead and, uh, yeah. Look, they tell you some shit that ain't your problem. And they ain't want you to figure it out. And, and that's their problem. You know, they ain't got nothing to do with it. You know what I'm saying? It's natural though. I'm telling you, like when you become, when it, that when that's your personality, people naturally gravitate yeah. towards you, and they tell you things. And the first time, it's kind of like a stray cat or a dog. You feed it one time. It yeah, like Jason. Around. We had this so cat yesterday. You get the information. <laughs> Chill out. That's Corey home. You get the information yeah, cat, out. Cat was crazy. Too. One time. Okay. Like they gonna keep coming to you ass. Like you gotta like nip it in the bud, right or got, yeah, like, so. it is, sometimes it ain't even your personality. It's just like you just trying to. Trying to be helpful. Yeah, yeah you being I, I friendly. Think, think and, that, you know what in that sense, that's where you fuck yourself up. Yeah, that's all it is. But don't. About you you got to protect your energy. And some it's good to help people, but sometimes you got to, like, you know, right. when to, like, you know. Just say no. Even when I talk to certain, like, family members, you know, I call. And <clears throat> when I when I talk to them, they start dumping a whole lot of shit on them. And I ain't call for this. Like, goddamn. Like, yeah. Understand, but. Like, come on, man. Like, so you just got to understand. You got to protect your energy. You can take it in. You can listen to people. Sometimes people just want to get shit off their chest, but don't let that shit affect your energy. Right. And with that, Corey wasn't in the goddamn camera, so we're going to have to cut the segment. We back. So we talking about we got a lot of talented people in this group, right? Mm-hmm. We got a nigga that made like the L. You see it. Hold up, you see it? The LV design on the motherfucking hat, man. We got a nigga yeah, that just that. do that. He did that. Just nigga just do that. We got a nigga that DJ. We got a nigga that uh Produces. edit podcasts. RH Media. Security. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we got no. um nigga that be on the block. <laughs> slinging the rock. Nah. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Give him too much. I'm giving too much. Got, <laughs> everybody on the other side of the cap. Got we you know what I'm saying? 
little saucy. We got a um, it's a talented group. Like, how do y'all feel, man, when y'all get recognized for your 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 talent or not recognized for your talent in a certain way? You know what I'm saying? Like, does it make you? Does it push you to go harder when you when you when you recognize or not recognize? Because mm. if you know you're doing something and you're not recognized, that can push you to go harder. And when you do get that recognition for doing something that's dope, how does that push you? How does how how do how do both of those play into what you do, or or does it? Do y'all understand what I'm saying? Or accent? Yeah, I, think I understand what you're saying. I think when you get, you know, when you get, once you get that recognition of something that you know you're doing right, I think that pushes that one even further. Makes like, you want to go that much harder. Yeah, like you know, I'm doing. I'm I, if I feel myself doing this, and then somebody will say, "Hey, man, man, that was good." Would you just, like, damn, I was really doing it on that. But on depends on the individual. Note, it it oh. it can be it can be different on another note too. Yeah, that's why I say depend on individual. Be. What you mean by that? Because either way, it can go. It can it, whatever motivates you though. You know what I'm saying? The negative or the positive. I like, think both can. Yeah, what the, both. Yeah, yeah motivation. Yeah, one could do one thing. One could do the other thing. And like depend you know, person. yeah. Hmm. But so, like, be like, look, be like Raul. I got a store. Okay. So. Just like I happened to go to the store the other day, and you know we wearing masks on, so I don't recognize nobody unless I know you know you. So this girl was like, "Hey, hey, Jason, what's going on?" I'm like, "Uh, what's up? I don't know who the hell that is." It throw me off. It did. I like, what's going on? I'm like, hey, you still working such and such? I'm like, yeah. So you know, she asked about T's. I'm like, oh, I really don't know who this is. Yeah. She's like. So yo, so season still I like, yeah. I'm thinking my mind like, who the fuck is you? I still don't know who this is. Thought y'all y'all, y'all still y'all still working there, ain't doing shit. I was like, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> I like, you know what? Perspective is everything. I was like, well, it's nice seeing you. I like, mm hmm. She gonna she said that to your face. She said it to my face, girl. That's cool. I feel like it's kind. I mean, that's cool. I don't know if she was joking I, or not. Like, but I feel like it's a little bit of disrespect on that little see, bit. Was, was a little, she threw a little salt. A little bit. Of, it was like, a little, 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 little bit of salt in my eye. I like, mm, all right. The way you Bitch, said you it. Man, she could going, have been playing. I'm going but, better than you, But nigga. at yeah. the same time, I ain't going to act like I know you because I really don't remember you. I think that's to be the main thing. I don't like when, I ain't going to say I don't like it, but it kind of throw me off when somebody say something to me about something that I did on like the internet. And I don't know them in real life. Mm. It throw me off. Like, I, like, huh? you did such and such. Oh, yeah. Huh? I don't know. What? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, okay. All right, cool. I'd be like, okay, that's cool, but I don't know you for real. So that shit throw me off a little bit. I don't know how to deal with it. I don't know. I don't even know what you call that. Is that, is that, um, it's recognition, but what if they, I'm saying they give you a compliment though, yeah. they throw you no, off. Still. I mean, it, it usually be a compliment. I ain't never had nobody come to me sideways, but like, that's some, fuck but shit, yeah. I don't know how I would react if someone did come at me sideways. I don't think I'll be mad, but I don't know how I, how I would react. You know what I'm saying? I just get, I just be like, okay, all right. You take it with stride. Y'all don't you say thank you. Initially, yeah. Oh, okay. Go ahead, go ahead. Hold on, both. You way better than me, cause I don't think it would end like that if Bumper told me, "Yo, y'all still ain't doing shit." Basically, doing yeah. Shit. That shit, shit like that don't bother me though, man. Yeah. Like you don't know me. Like I you don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I don't why really give two fucks. Me, but I'm gonna put you in your place. I'm gonna let you know. The thing about me, I don't I ain't even know the bro. Like, oh, but for I ain't real though, like, real like how you gonna say that? I mean, you don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Exactly. That that's my, that's why I, I felt like that. that angle. That's you don't know me. Are you? That might have been the angle that I played. I'm like, I, bitch, you I was in <laughs> when? <laughs> Where? Back what what year? Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, cool. Mm-hmm. Those situations, I got a bad habit of. How did that shit roll off? <laughs> Being that one that like 
if that shit was that shit happened to me, I got a bad habit of being the one that just snap. I'm gonna I'm gonna snap, but I'm gonna snap in a way that I'm gonna verbally beat your ass real quick. <laughs> Because but, but then, you don't that's, fucking I think know that's me. The only, only, the only reasonable response. Yeah, like, like you don't know that. me and have no fucking idea what I'm doing. Right. So you know what? Just to shut you the fuck. I wanna, I wanna see your face when I tell you real quick. I don't have to. When I tell you real quick, let me, let me tell you where I'm at right now. And I'm gonna give you a little bit, and I'm gonna boom, shut it down real quick. I'm going about my business. Don't you ever approach me again on a dumb shit like exactly. that. Exactly. You don't know me. Exactly. Like nah, bro, nah. I'm a, I, that's where I think Corey was saying like, yeah, you better than me because I, I'm going to at least tell you, even though I don't have to. Most of them I wouldn't, but if you come at me like that, you got to get this work real quick. I feel like it's a little this verbal work that she put on it. Being disrespectful. Yeah, she put a little disrespect, disrespect on it for no reason. It's like, cold, like disrespect can only be like, met with disrespect. <laughs> you feel? That's how I feel. I'm going you come with me with disrespect. Disrespect gonna come back at you. I'm gonna tell you what's going on. Tim, walk about my business. Does that disrespect um, motivate you in any type of way, or does it just? It's. It depends. I think it depends on who it come from. And you better be Some top. people don't fucking matter. You better be. This top this period. is why I say it don't matter because I don't period. remember you. Right. Yeah. I don't know you who you are. Be, you better be. I doing, might not even have to tell you what I got. Going but the on. thing is, go yeah. like you, that, no. yeah. bitch, That's you better be saying, doing like, ten times better than me if you coming at me like. Yeah. But the thing about it is, you know me. I don't remember you. You remember me though. So what kind of person I put on? We put on your ass. Did you remember us? Well, this is a whole another different kind well, of stunt. I don't remember. I don't remember nothing you ever exactly. did. Exactly. I don't remember your name, but what you, you did. Me, exactly. Look at That's you. how I felt. I like. Yeah. All right. You remember me though? That, that keep that in. Right keep there. that in the front of your Look mind. Look at you. Exactly. That, that, mm. Does she even deserve like a response? Right. Shit right she there, did. You gonna bro. remember me she like got this? What I, she Bitch, got you better remember me. I'm like this. I'm right here now. I'm going here. So you better remember when I'm here. Bitch, you don't even know me like that. Don't talk to me, bitch. (laughs) Don't ever say nothing to me, bitch. I ain't angry, man. (laughs) Angry, man. Hold on. See that? Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Before you stop. No, go ahead. Before I cut you off. Go ahead. All right, let me say this. For the people that don't know me, a lot of people don't know me, (laughs) I'm never going to come at you with disrespect. And if you come at me with disrespect, I'm trying to go above and beyond the disrespect. I don't give a fuck about you. Sauce on it. If I'm not never coming at nobody with no disrespect. If you come at me with disrespect, fuck you and fuck your family. Fuck your grandma, nigga. <laughs> fuck you. Fuck the baby shower. Yeah. I, boom. I, all that shit. Kick boom. Man, right. Y'all already yeah. know what that boom me. I, I fuck all that shit. <laughs> I fuck see. you, your grandma, your aunt, your your auntie, all that shit. I don't give a fuck about you. If you come at me with disrespect, if you come at me with respect, I'm you coming to you with yeah, all the respect in the world until we get to that point. Fuck you if we get to that other point. Fuck you. So a bitch come at me with some disrespect, fuck you. Fuck everything you talking about. I feel you. Amen to that shit. I 100% agree with you Amen yeah. to that shit I, 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 I concur Yeah, yeah. Um, On the flip side though Standard. If it's, it's If it is Certified Somebody like Comes at you With compliments And Admiration For what you're doing How do, how do you receive that Does that Make you go I'm harder I'm gonna say some shit I'm gonna say some shit I ain't hear nobody say it right <laughs> Yeah I, I think all of us feel it Whether you wanna say it or not But if you put like all of that work in. I know for me personally from experience, it's like, you know, growing up and shit. And like the only two things I was like, this all I want to do is all I did was sports and music, right? So I know every time somebody told me like, yo, you was whatever, you, like I felt a sense of cockiness a little bit. Mm-hmm. That made you feel cocky? Yeah. Or was it just- Because I felt like I'm supposed to be doing this. <laughs> Like you, if you if you get to, if you on that <laughs> level, I'm sorry. I, I don't know if he grown man getting the hiccups. I, got, I get the hiccups from time to time, bro. Grown man getting the hiccups, bro. <laughs> nah, because Cut I didn't this shit before. Like, grown man getting the hiccups. I don't know what's fucking hey, going on. You sure or did your heart stop just now? <laughs> I'm sorry, man. My, my hiccups be acting up. Man, I'm sorry. <laughs> I 
Oh my god! That's okay. when the cabin pressure dropped. Just oh man, my he goes be acting up. Out the room. Y'all remember the episode where I had he like yes. the whole shit? Yes, man. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You need some water? What the fuck? Hold your breath. I'm sorry, man. Hold your breath and swallow. Yes, yeah, so but why is it? Why is it? Um. A sense of arrogance when it when it's meant like that because you because you said you, because you say you feel like you're supposed to be doing it anyway. Like you're supposed to be doing like if you so if you if y'all ever had something that you feel like you know I don't know if you want to say a hobby or <laughs> just something like a hobby if it's something that you're real good at and you and you you practice you work at it you want to get to the point where you feel like you're the best in that field right so when people give you there's people that's watching you who don't know what you put into to get to where you're at. And when they give you compliments or whatever, it makes you feel like, like yo, they noticed I'm good at what I'm doing. I it's, get that, but is that, that's not, I don't know if that's translate to cockiness though. That's like, okay, that's nah, real, it gets, it's so reassurance. You, it's like, so, ah, nah, so you, so, ah, you, you see it. Not nah, so. Okay, bro, bro, the way you just said that you was see cocky. it. You the see way you it. said that was cocky, bro. <laughs> but nah, it's not cockiness. It's just reassurance, though. Cocky, it's like that okay. was cocky. Though. It, is, uh, it is form of cockiness. That's form of cockiness. Nah, it's, bro. it's a little it's, bit of arrogance. No, it's it's. I think the way it's said is cockiness. You can be like, yeah, it's reassurance. I but you like, feel reassured that you did because sometimes you put in some work and it's like, bro, you don't know if anybody even like recognize give a fuck what you doing. But when somebody says it. But that's what I'm saying. You know, the whole question yeah, you gotta grab your balls. Like, yeah, yeah. We don't care about the ones who don't know. You don't like, know you those. Don't even worry about you worry about you. Yeah. You appreciate this. Right. So that person who comes to you and say, hey, look, damn, you out here killing it, whatever, whatever. Bruh, that shit at that moment makes you feel like shit. You dead motherfucker. That shit kind of right. humbled me a little bit, though. Mm. Yeah, I get can. more humble when I hear about a nigga that. They appreciate what we do. That's what I'm saying. I'm kind of saying that, it, That's what I'm saying. Pin on individual. It's like okay, you, you see it, but it's gonna make me go that much harder. Even the hate, if it's hate, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go that much more harder. Like okay, but nigga, you gonna all right? With the hate. All right, okay. You don't see it. Well, you I'm gonna show hate. you. No, I whoa, can show whoa. you better well, than you I can tell you. Hate, you trying to prove that's more like, arrogant to me. You got to hate. You trying to I'm prove gonna show you wrong. I'm gonna show you. When you, got the, when you got somebody that's on your, they on your team already. So now you trying to get them more what they like. You got somebody that's hating, you trying to prove them wrong. Yeah, all right. So how you just said that's, how, how is that hate? Like if, if somebody's hating on you and you say, all right, then you don't see it. I'm going to go, how is that arrogance? Because I'm, a, I'm, I'm maybe, it, maybe I'm, maybe I suck. Maybe I do suck. But that's going to make me not, it's going to. See what I'm saying? Like I'm, I'm gonna take that as disrespect. Even they might be right. I might suck. To me, that's more like motivation. Man, but yeah, that's what I'm yeah. saying. But so I might suck. But I'm gonna prove to that's you. Motivation. I think they yeah, both. I think they both motivation. Yeah, that's they what I'm are. saying. Yeah, but I'm, like, I'm gonna take it to another level for the one both. that think I suck and the one that think I'm doing yeah. something. Both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right. I'm gonna keep climbing, and you gonna keep seeing. That's this. exactly what I'm but saying. But I think that you should take more into account of the person that fuck with you instead of the person that don't. Yes, maybe. So yeah. that's why I say, like, give that person that don't <clears throat> that do fuck with you more what they like instead of the person that don't fuck with you trying to make them like. You. I want to piss. Fuck them. I don't want them to like Just me. Just do whatever the person that do like you get them more. The that one shit. that don't like me, I don't want them to like me. I want to piss on them. Whoa. Okay, Kim. I'm, hey, yo, I'm, I'm with keep, you. I'm hey, keep, but you know what? Keep going. I'm, I'm no, I'm keep with you. Going. Going. But I'm with I, you. I hope you pissing keep, on that means you keep doing what you're doing yeah, and you and get better. And I hope better. they keep not liking me. Uh, yeah, yeah. And right. they're gonna be like, damn, the nigga's still doing it. And he yeah. Really, he really doing and it he, now. And he winning. Yeah. And I can't do shit about it. Yeah. And I told him he wasn't shit. Well, who's that? Who's that? Look at him now. Two trade. So like. Even if I say if somebody gives me positive shit, I could be cocky with it, but it it can also mean it humbles me at the same time. Yeah. So yeah. you can have yeah. multiple. Yeah, like, like yeah. You, that. That's possible. So right. even though personal spirit, even though I have been cocky with somebody say, "Yo, you out here killing it, boom, boom, boom," it's a sense of cockiness, like, "Yo," because I feel like I'm talented. I, I'm supposed to be doing this. Like, right. if you if you appreciate this shit. I'm feeling good about what I'm doing right now. I'm hot right now. I'm cocky with it. Like, yeah. No, it's only cocky but, when you show it. When you like, if somebody gives you a compliment, you're like, yeah, nigga, I know. That's the cockiness. You feeling good about them saying it isn't cocky. Maybe not showing the cockiness, you know but having this inside. You can show it, bro. 
I think a different way. You don't have to just show it by speaking it. Your body language. I think you, yo, yeah, body language could be one. I mean, right. it's different things you can do. You you can start. You can hear it, and then whatever it is that you're doing, you can hear it at the moment, and you can start doing it a little different with a little more sauce with it. You know what I'm saying? Like it ain't just verbal. I think it's different ways you can show that shit. There you are. Whatever works for you. Let it work for you. Works for you. I'm gonna say this before we put a put a tail on down. Wrap it up because yeah. you ain't in the frame again. When nigga. this gonna come out? But today was I got some news that was disturbing, and I just want to say this and have it on tape, just in case it don't. Work out in the favor of this person, but prayers up for prayers. Him in for sure, for sure, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. For sure. That nigga did some amazing shit in his time. And amazing. Damn, addiction is a hell of a thing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So. He's been fighting this shit for a long yeah, time. Yeah, yeah man. It's a never end yeah. fight. Yeah. We are. We That's know somebody like that. That's something that you. If we all you know somebody like it, that. You fighting that forever. Yeah. Yeah. But oh, I was cool. outside when. That nigga that, dropped them two albums in six months. He's be my was it, favorite 98? or one yeah. of my favorite. I, I was outside yeah, heavy yeah. when he dropped them two albums in six months and they was both number one and you had to go yeah. to the yeah. store and yeah. buy the yeah. album. You know how crazy. I had like, the when DMX dropped, yeah, I don't think niggas know how crazy it was when he dropped. You had to go get DMX shit. You had to go the to the store. That was going on at the time. That's yeah. that's what these young kids don't understand, right? You had to actually go to get the, the physical store copy. You had to get that and buy it. You had to get it because you, you couldn't have it no way else. There was the only way you can get no it. way you can get it. He was one of the first to do that. that yeah, they come out with the do it. They drop platinum. Some album. of the best intro drop. we ever heard. He, he dropped the shits within what eight months six, of each six other. Months, it, it was six eight months. Yeah, it was like six months apart. But like any, I, it, I, I know the, the the second one was in December, so yeah. whatever six months. Uh, so I guess the other one was in, in the, the summertime. summertime. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but it was that was ridiculous. Yeah, it was crazy. And outside. him in concert too. Hey, prayers up for his family. Segment. Prayers up for him. Um, prayers up for his family. He Hoping been you pull that, through. That, that um, drug shit for a long time. Man. Up, and that shit. Because I don't know if y'all heard how he. It almost got him this you time. You heard the story how he got. Yes. Yeah. Yes. It wasn't purpose. Yes. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's fucked up. Yeah, shout out to DMX, man. Press up. I hope you make it through this shit. Like you said, we um we record these well in advance, so but so press up. After this shit come out, hopefully he all right. Um, on on the road of recovery or whatever, when y'all see this, but yeah, that shit is crazy. Once again, if you've made it this far, thank you for tuning in to another episode of the legend has it podcast man we are the legendary visionaries this is the first time that we have recorded an episode with all six members of the legendary visionaries so this is a milestone for us this you see us yeah 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 this will probably be like episode 30 or something like that but you see us season um, two and you see the drip see us we coming DM. Yeah 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 So if you made it this far Thank you for tuning in Once again man Live with a sense of urgency A sense of purpose If you want something Go out there and motherfucking get it man Stop yeah. acting like your life You're gonna live playing. Gonna last forever Because it's not Bitch. Tomorrow could be your last day So you go get it Go get it I go by the name of artwork Bo in the building See Bo If you want one of these shirts Hit us in our Instagram page In the DM Immediately Already, Already. Hey. Put it out there. And this Bruh. your boy, Mr. VA, my fault. Man, I got caught up. <laughs> <laughs> your boy, Jay Herb, a.k.a. Uncle Irby. And it's the illustrious R.H., a.k.a. Raul. We are the legendary visionaries. Moppy Carpet. I don't know how I feel about you saying illustrious. That's him. Yeah. Nigga, that's, that's me. Him, that's him. Lustrous. Mafia Carvey. Sure. You want to get off your chest? Oh, that's Ooh, me, man. Wash your ass. We do. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, we, we do this next episode. Read a book. Next episode. Read a book. Hold on, hold on. We do this next episode. We are.